Well, today I'm in the Lake District again, and that's Blaine Cathra. I'm going to try using, see if we can get it in there. Can you see that? Oh, an infrared filter on my smartphone. It's a Hoya infrared R72. And what I'm going to do is, I'm going to put it over the lens. And it turns into infrared photo. I'll take a picture of that and I'll convert it to black and white. I thought I'd try this with my DSLR. Well, you see what I've done here. I've put the filter gently against the glass of my wide angle lens and I've put that little stick to hold it up because I was holding it in front on the UV filter. I was getting a bit of light leakage around the outside, as you can see. Right, what I'm doing is I'm trying to focus in. That's it. Oh, there we go. Come on, well, there, ten times. See how the things are sharp, the leaves are sharp there. I've put it on aperture priority and set the ISO 100 ISO and left the shutter speed to take care of itself. And I've just overexposed by one stop. Don't know why, just have this feeling that should be right. <laughs> So, oops. So here goes. Let's try and touch the camera. It's about 30 second exposure. That's the image there in glory, glorious cherry vision. But because of the filter which covers the sensor, it didn't turn out and didn't give the you that snowy whiteness it just looked like a very very deep red filter when converted to the black and white
Well, as usual, it's clouded over again. And even though the sun's still out, the, the, it's high cloud and it's all gone milky white. But I think I'll just hang around to see what happens. It's about oh, 10 to 7 or something like that, so I might as well hang around until the sunset about nine uh, there's no point in going anywhere else I can't think of anywhere else I could get to for a possible sunset shot and the way the hills are here the sun will sort of like glide slowly following the contour of the hill so I might get some golden light I still got the camera set up on those two trees um, sorry those three trees uh, so I'll just wait and see if uh, anything happens get any sort of like different look then again sometimes we call it you know um, twilight soft direction light looks quite good might, might look make it look like a um, what was it a watercolor uh, especially with all this uh, lime well, I hope it's lime that was spread on the fields. There was a, well, was a couple walking through and a, they said, what's the white stuff? And I said it was poison. <laughs> it, just, it shocked them. <laughs> I says, no, it's just lime. Just to help the grass grow in these impoverished upland pastures. They always need a bit of lime to get things going. Right, it's just a question of waiting now. So I thought I'd play with the drone and look what happened. Thanks for watching this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. Also turn on those annoying 3 in the morning notifications to keep you up to date with all new videos.